Hello everyone, today's Pharma Studio would be discussing ways to prevent medication errors. So, what is medication errors? Medication error is any error that happens in the process of ordering, preparation, dispensing, administering and monitoring of a medication. It is an unintended failure in the treatment process that leads to, or has the potential to lead to, harm to the patient. The most common causes of medication error are First, misinterpreted prescription Second, lack of counseling to patient Third, confusion due to similar drug names Next, a legible prescription And lastly might be due to patient overload The types of medication errors can be classified into Prescription errors, omission errors, wrong time errors, unauthorized drug errors, improper drugs errors, wrong dosage form errors, wrong dose preparation errors, wrong administration technique errors, deteriorated drug errors, monitoring errors, and lastly compliance errors. First, prescription errors occur when the prescriber orders drug for a specific patient. The errors could come from the drug, dose, dosage form, route of administration, length of therapy, number of doses, administration, drug concentration, inadequate or incorrect instruction for use, and illegible handwriting of prescriber. Omission errors occur when there is failure to administer an ordered dose, but it not considered as a late dose. Omitted dose is not an error when patient cannot take anything by mouth. Healthcare providers are waiting for drug level results. Or patient refuses to take the medication. Every drug has standardized administration times, however it is still acceptable if the administration time interval is surrounding schedule time. It is occasionally unavoidable if the patient is away care area for test. Or the medication is not available at the time it is due. Next, unauthorized drug error happens when the administration of medication to a patient without proper authorization by the prescriber. It could be due to medication given to another patient instead, or two patients share a prescription. Now, let's discuss the ways to prevent medication error. First and foremost, we must confirm that the prescription is correct and complete. For example ambiguous prescriptions, non-standard abbreviations, acronyms, decimals, and colon prescriptions are frequently associated with medication errors. Therefore, whenever in question, it is important to call the prescriber to clarify any uncertainties or doubts regarding the prescription. Next, be aware of look-alike and sound-alike drugs. Similar names and packaging lead to many errors. The way to prevent this problem is to highlight those medications on your shelves and in your computer system so that staff members are paying attention. Next, we must know the known common mistakes. Download a copy of the Institute for Safe Medication Practices list of error-prone abbreviations, symbols, and dose designations and train staff members to recognize potential errors. Besides, always alert and have a second pair of eyes check prescriptions. One way to prevent human error is by involving a second human either a pharmacist or pharmacist assistant, in the dispensing process. Next, provide patient counseling is also very important to prevent medication errors. Informing patients on how to properly take the medication rather than just handing the bag directly to them. This will offer opportunities for questions to be asked and verifications to be performed. Also, opening the containers and showing them the contents prevents errors, as patients can raise an alert if the medication looks different from what they usually take. Counseling should also include instructions on how to take the medication and the appropriate route of administration. Many dispensing errors are attributed to misunderstood directions for use. I hope you learned something new today. Thank you for watching.